Hey guys, obviously I wanted to provide an update um, now that stage 11 has been won and run. I have had a look at the breakaway options for tonight's stage, stage 12. As I said earlier, I definitely think this is going to be a breakaway stage. Um, uh, you know, listening to the Eurosport commentators yesterday, they certainly thought that was the case. And I'm glad for that was the case. Um, so that, I definitely think that's the way that it's going to go. So, um, my list of selections for this evening. So, um, first one is Yon Izigie, um, priced up at $26 at Sportsbet. Look, I think Astana in general are going to be super, super aggressive. Um, Obviously, uh, Bill Bowles obviously won a stage already, uh, and that's certainly the certainly key to continue to um, continue their run of great form so far. So he's my first selection. Next selection is uh, Sosa from Ineos. Uh, he's uh, twenty-six dollars at Bluebell, twenty-nine dollars at Bluebell, I think. Um, if you're an Australian watching this, Bluebell, great odds, get on them. Um, so, look, I think Ineos are going to be very, very aggressive these second and third weeks. It was a toss-up between him and Dunbar. Um, I've gone with Sosa because he can climb, and uh, so look, I definitely think he's, he's one for the breakaway. Uh, next selection, Bataglin. Uh, um, same price as Sosa. He was in the break the other day. Uh, stage 7, I think it was. Yep, uh, the Bill Bauer one. Uh, so, look, I think he'll be, he'll be looking for, for the break. Um, Davide Formolo is my next selection from Bora. He was third the other day, um, meant to be running for GC, but um, look, I think he will he will definitely be in the mix of this. He was in the breakaway the other day, so confident he'll be up for this again. I think Mike is probably targeting this and targeting GC, and maybe Formolo is thinking, well, if I can place high on GC and win a stage, you know, maybe he's, he's hedging his bets a little bit, but. Um, you know, great win at Catalonia, can climb, decent finish off him, so I think that's um, that's a, an obvious one. Um, Polank, Jan Polank, I think, I've been watching him since Tour Down Under this year. He, look, he's been doing really, really well without actually winning anything yet, and I think he, he's been, like, I think he's going to win a stage in this year's Giro for sure. Um, I preferred him over Ulysses. I think they seem to have been saving Polang's legs over the last week or so. He hasn't been doing as much work as, say, Ulysses has. So I prefer to take Polang at uh, Polang at 50, $51 as opposed to Ulysses at um, $15. Um, James Knox, um, that's my my next selection. Quick step. Viviani's gone home. Eighty-one dollars at Blue Bear. Um, yeah, look, I think uh, yeah. Again, um, Viviani's gone home, so he's not going to be on lead out GD anymore. Um, again, I think a solid option. Can climb very well. He was in the breakaway for that Catalonia stage for Formula One, and he was riding as strong as. Um, he rode with the eights for a while as well before finally getting dropped, having been in the break all day. Um, so that can definitely climb. Um, I think he, he's definitely got options. Um, so yeah, so and uh, Cataneo as well. Again, been riding in the breaks um, and has been going well. So just a, a repeat because I was rambling a little bit and I'm looking at my phone to make sure I've got all the selections for you guys down so um, main, main the selections for me are uh, Yoni Zagie $26 at Sportsbet Sosa $29 at Bluebet Polank $51 at Bluebet Knox $81 at Bluebet um, Formulo $67 at Bluebet um, Cataneo and Bataclan are uh, 26 and 29 dollars. So it's Izagie, Sosa, Polank, Knox, Cataneo, Formolo and Bataclan for tonight's stage. Let's see how we go. Take it easy guys. We'll have another one of these hopefully up tomorrow. Um, probably going to start recording that later. We'll keep pumping out the content. If you like these videos, hit the subscribe button. 
hit the like button, share them, whatever, ask me questions. You know, you guys know what to do. And uh, yeah, see you tomorrow.